the 13th is associated with bad luck. Don't ask me why, because I don't know the origins. I just know that every time it's Friday the 13th, people walk a little more cautiously. They look both ways before they cross the street. I mean, people should be doing that anyway. But maybe there's like something that happened in like the 1600s where like millions of people had explosive diarrhea on Friday the 13th. That's why people are so cautious about Friday the 13th. But no more talking about Friday the 13th. That was so last year. Do you know what happened on Thursday the 12th? If you don't, I have a game that explains exactly what happens on that day. If you guys are cool with that, you down with that? Everybody get ready and buckle up, cause here we go! So it starts off like this. Madison says, Hey boys, I have a challenge for you. If you can do it, you'll get a special reward tonight. Alright! They won't have the courage. They're both fearful. I am not afraid. I am not afraid of anything. You can send the challenge. Come on, girls. Tonight, I want my reward. Ten years ago, a young man lived in this forest with his mother in a wooden house. The boy was a little strange until one day he killed his mother with a scythe, cut off her head, and kept it in a chest. Damn, that's a bad boy. That's a bad, bad boy right there. Since then, he started killing everyone who came close to his house. They say his mother's head is still in that chest. I dare you to go to the house and get the murderer's mother's head. If you want the reward, you have to do this. I'm not afraid. I will if Mike goes too. This is just a legend. Let's go to this house and prove that there is nothing there. All right, let's go. But before we do, and this guy does not know anything about personal bubbles, my boy. And why are you going camping in a suit and tie? You know what? I'm not even worried about it. Let's go. Let's do our thing. And I want my reward because I'm getting that head in that house and my reward should be use tab to access the inventory and use the flashlight. Oh, okay, cool. Complimentary horror game flashlight. You know what I'm saying? Padlock. Very strong padlock. I need something to break it. You don't have the key? How'd you get in here then? Do you know four-eyed freak? You don't know anything. You don't even know it from down. You don't even know that we're probably dying tonight, do you? I need to get something for the woods out. I did not even read that sentence in the English language. Wait, there's a door here. How come I can't go inside the door? Hold up. Hey, fuck boy. Do you know how we get out of here? I need something to break down those boards. But I don't know where I can get... Actually, wait, wait, wait. What is this? Hold on. Ooh. Ooh la la. Tonight at midnight. We'll be at third base, man. Yeah, where you at? We'll be at third base, man. Haha. <laughs> Let's find this crazy guy's house. And if there really is a human head in there, girls want to have sex, bro. Don't screw it up. <laughs> Relax, man. I even wore my father's clothes. It makes me more mature. That's a yikes. That's a cringe. I'm cringing inside my body right now. How do we get in here? Oh, wait. Greg. Hold me, Greg. I'm scared, Greg. Oh, old pliers. Yeah, fuck yeah for all players, baby! Alright, so... Where the hell am I? What is this shit? Greg! Greggy! Stop scaring me, Greggy! Why are you hiding in those bushes, my boy? Alright, so we got the pliers. And let's make a skirt right here. And wait, maybe I can get this padlock off? No. Oh, I need something to break it. Hold on. How about the pliers? Got them. Nope, that doesn't work. Okay. I guess we'll pinch these boards off. I need something to get the woods out. I got the woods. I wish you woods. Greg, I need help, dude. I actually don't understand what's happening right here. I need something to break it. You know what? I don't like where this is going. Because I'm holding old-ass pliers. And I'm not getting any closer to my goal of getting that reward from the ladies. Hey, ladies. Oh, there you go. Okay. So here we go go this is actually the house isn't it greg oh greg you're inside me <laughs> what the hell why is greg inside me oh shit greg <sighs> mike you enter the house and i stay outside to watch with all four of those eyes you better see somebody i swear it's saving that's not good oh shit this is not good at all everybody oh crap what is going on here hey greg greggy boy Greggy Poo! This is creepy. Oh, fuck. This is it? Holy shit, the legend is real! We got the head. Head confirmed. Greg? Greggy? Oh, 
Oh, fuck, Greggy! Okay. I did not mean to take your mother's head, but you took my boy's life. So let's call it even. Or not. Nah. Okay, we're not gonna call it even. Oh, shit! Bitch roars like a dinosaur! My God! Ah! No! Wait! Who oh, fuck! Go! What? You got bitch! Oh my god. I'm sorry, Greg. Oh fuck. Wait! I can't leave! Ah! Go! Ah! There was an invisible video game barrier. I know you're about to die in 10 seconds, but I just want to say that. I'll make it up for you. I'll get the reward from both girls. In your honor, okay? In your honor. Let's do this. Wait, where's the head? Oh, I already have the head! Oh, shit! Okay, so we have the mom's head in our possession. Oh, fuck. This is bad. Look at this. He is getting chopped up. This is borderline overkill, everybody. And why does he look like he has toilet paper on his head? I don't even know what that is. But you know what? I'm sorry. I have your mom's head, and that's what it is. It is what it is. It is what it is. Where do I go? Oh, hi, hi, hi. Wait, why is the head outside? The mom's head's outside. The skull is literally right there. She does look like her son. I can see the features. It's in the cheekbones. What? What? I gave you a compliment. Don't do this to me. Am I dead? Can I take the thing out of my inventory? Okay. We got it. We got it. We got it. Don't you dare poke yourself in here. Don't you double doggy style dare. I need to bring the head to the ladies, all right? They're expecting your mother's head, and I am going to give it to them. I'm Uber Eats with the shits. I am going to deliver everything you ask for. Wait. The music's stopping. I still hear him, though. He is moaning. He is moaning like a horny hyena. And I've heard those moans. They're not pleasant. Where's he going? Okay. He's walking around with all that ass. Do I wait for the sounds to go away? Oh, he went downstairs. Okay, cool. Let's take his mom's heads out. Yeah. Shit. I need to get to the camp. Let's go. Let's do this. I'm sorry, my boy. Damn. He set traps all over the place. I'm not worried about that. I'm not worried about that. I'm not worried about that trap shit. Watch this. Check me out. Turn me up, baby. Turn me up, baby. Let's go. Yeah. Come on, girls. Let's get it, girls. Oh, shit. My God. I'm sorry, girls. Wait, my reward. Fuck. Crowbar. Okay. I know exactly what to do with this. Oh, fuck. Okay, it's just me and you now. I want my reward. Fuck this. I think we have to go inside this house, everybody. Let's see. Remove planks. Yep. All right. Let's get it then. What's going on in here? Examine. It looks like an altar. I should put something here. All right. Mom's head. Oh, fuck. What does that say? Kill that monster. With what? I only have a complimentary horror game flashlight. Wait, is there anything in here? Whose bones are these? What the fuck? Um. I'm dead. Oh, shit. What? What? Hold on. What do I do? Oh, God. Run. I don't know what to do. How did I not see the radio and the revolver right here below the altar? Did the mom just give me a gift from the great beyond? It says manage your bullets well. You know why they call me Mr. J? Because I don't miss, baby. Get your ass over here. Get your ugly ass over here. Bop. Bop. Die. Now I need to use the radio and ask for help. Why would you tell him die? He's already dead. Help. Please. 911. Help me. Oh, God. What the fuck? He woke up. He woke up. How did he wake up? I put two in the chest. All right. Sometimes things don't make sense. But you know what? In the Friday the 13th movies, Jason never dies. Like, you could literally chop his head off. And he will find a way to put that thing back together. So, manage my bullets well. That's the funniest joke that I've heard all day. Watch this. Come here. Get me out of here. I'm going to put one in his brain. Just because I can. Oh. Two in his brain. Two in the dome. Now I need to use the radio and ask for help. Watch this, look. How do I ask for help? Very strong padlock, I need something to break it. How about this? Ugh. Break that. Oh, I have to go up in this tree house. Okay, hello, help me. People weep up. Please, anyone listening, I need help. Hello, what do you need? 
My friends and I were attacked by an assassin in the woods of Southville. Only I survived. Okay, stay calm. Do you have any form of defense? I found a gun. I shot the killer twice. I think he's dead. Go back to your camp and I'll come over there. I'll be there in about 20 minutes. That's the dumbest thing that I've ever heard. Are you sure that the killer is not the ranger in disguise? Thanks, ranger. I'm heading there. Understood. What? No, I am not going back there. I guess I am. I'm about to clap some cheeks, baby. All right. Guess I'm going. This is ridiculous. I have 15 bullets. Okay, so I can't miss. Watch him be behind me. He's going to be right behind me, isn't he? No, he's not. His body is gone. Isn't that son of a bitch dead yet? Well, if his body's gone, then I'm pretty sure it's not. Unless a bear took him and ate his ass first. So I have to go back to the camp, right? Okay. Let's go back to the camp. Where are you? Oh, shit, there he is. All right, buddy. You disrespected my mother. Now you will die. Shoot the gas valve, face the killer, beg for your life. Okay, so I have three options. I'm gonna shoot the gas valve first. Oh, that's me? Why am I so swaggy? Oh yeah! Burn in hell just like your mother! Oh god. Oh! We burned the clothes and the flesh. That's savage. And that's how it's done, everybody. Barbecue chicken on Thursday the 12th. That's what happened. So now we're gonna choose face the killer. Watch this. Bop, 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 bop. Okay, body armor, okay! What in the world? Come on, boy. Uh, uh. Yeah. You thought it was sweet? Here, get the bag, baby. Thursday the 12th is the day you got the bag. Back at the boss sack. So the last option we're gonna choose is beg for your life. AKA something I would never do in real life because I don't beg. I don't beg nobody. Please, murderer. Spare my life. Please. Please don't hurt me. Oh, I thought I was gonna shit my pants. Who wears your shorts? Go take your ass. What does that mean? What? Go take my ass? Take my ass where? This dude just took my head instead of taking my ass. <laughs> Bro said go take your ass. That is one of the most ambiguous things that you could say. Like, it doesn't mean anything. Like, you can interpret that any way you can. But yeah, everybody, that is another hit from 616 Games. I love these short little games. And the fact that you're all enjoying them too just makes it that much better. Because I'm enjoying it. You're all enjoying it. And 616 Games is just churning these games out like butter. If you want me to play any more games that they come out with in the future, make sure you give this video one big fat like. And tell a friend today that Jay from the Cub Scouts is that dude.